So guys, GM, I just woke up, had myself a cup of coffee, and I was browsing the Compass Mining Marketplace as one does, and I noticed that at the very top of the list, based on the Compass Mining score, was a T19. And that shocked me, because why would a T19 be at the top of the list? Obviously, there's more efficient miners on the marketplace. The reason was this. It was listed for only $100. So I was like, whoa, because um, I'm used to seeing S19J Pros at the top of the list, generally speaking. So I did the quick math in my head. This thing's 84 terahash. So at 84 terahash, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to calculate how much is this going to make because basically... The hosting fee for, for a T19 is what, a hundred and, uh, a hundred and eighty two dollars per month. So at 84 terahash, right now hash price is like seven cents. So obviously you're going to take terahash, which is 84 on this model that I purchased. You're going to multiply that by seven cents. So that should be $5.88 per day. <clears throat> There's an average of 30.4 days in the month. And you got to factor in for uptime. So at 100% uptime, you'd be at a, about $179 at current hash price. $179 worth of Bitcoin. But we got to factor in for uptime. So let's use our 95 percent uptime service level and that puts my revenue my expected revenue for this t19 at 84 terahash i'm expecting at 95 percent uptime i'm expecting approximately 170 dollars worth of bitcoin per month so quick maths last time i was in school that's mining at a slight loss because the hosting pro the hosting fee is about 182 and I'm expecting about $170 in revenue. So this thing's going to be mining at a loss of about $12. And that's why it was only $100. Someone was getting rid of that machine. Um, but I only paid just over a dollar per terahash. So what can I do with this miner? I can sit on it. I can wait for the hash price to increase. I am bullish hash price, and that's why I'm buying miners. But this one was interesting because it was only 100 bucks. Someone's practically giving it away. Yes, it's mining at a $12 loss, but what can I do with that? I can either sit on it, potentially sell it to someone else on the Compass Mining Marketplace, um, or maybe I could solo mine through CK Pool and just take my chances and mine at a real loss unless I hit a block and then I have a really good day. So I think that's the strategy with this one. I picked up a miner for a hundred bucks. It was hard to say no to that. And I can mine at a slight loss. I can flip this machine or I can solo mine and roll the dice and hope for a really good day. Let me know in the comments, what would you do if you picked up a machine for a hundred bucks, 84 terahash, are you solo mining? Are you gonna try to resell it? Or are you just gonna sit on it and wait for hash price to increase? So you're mining profitably. Let me know in the comments what you would do. I think I'm going to solo mine this one. Peace out. Uh, TikTok next block. Keep on hashing, folks, um, because we're going to make it. The, uh, the next bull run is on its way. So, um, uh, yeah, let me know what you think, and I'll see you guys next time.